Yo, are you feeling stuck with Roblox scripting? You want to get started, but you have no idea where to even begin. Trust me, I've been there. But stick around because by the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to start scripting on Roblox, even if you've never written a single line of code in your life. We're going to cover everything from the basics of how to learn scripting to monetizing your skills. So, Let's dive in. So I'm SmartyRBX and I'm the creator of the number one scripting guide in the world. I've taught millions of developers how to script on Roblox. And today I'm gonna share with you a step-by-step -step guide on how to get started right now. No fluff, no wasting time, just the real steps you need to take to learn scripting on Roblox. So let's get started. First things first, if you're watching this video and you haven't seen my beginner guide on how to script on Roblox, start with that. If you watch that video, you will learn all the basics you need to get started in Roblox scripting, like the syntax, the basic concepts, and how to start piecing those skills together into full scripts. You can open the video in the top right hand corner in a new tab and start learning, but don't just watch the video, start scripting now. Follow along and you'll see how quickly you'll improve as a scripter. So the second tip is to stop focusing on making games when you start. If you're watching this, you probably want to make Roblox games. You wanna make entire games on the platform and that's great. But if you've just started, the first thing you should do is Simply replicate simple features you like from your favorite games on Roblox. You could go into Pet Simulator 99 and you could look at the button animations or the way that they have the UI pop up when you get near the eggs to buy them. If you use your scripting skills to recreate these simple systems, it's one of the best ways to learn more about scripting and develop your skills. And it doesn't need to be perfect. It just needs to be good practice. This approach is a way to make scripting less intimidating and way more fun. Instead of making a big game first, start simple, make pieces of games. And then once you do this enough, you'll realize that you now have the skill to make entire games. But right now, start simple and use this approach to improve your skills gradually. Tip three. Be okay with looking things up. When I started as a scripter in 2021, I remember that I used to worry about looking things up all the time. I used to think that I wasn't as good of a scripter if I had to look things up. But as I went on in scripting, I began to notice that every scripter looks things up. Pro scripters still look things up as they code. Nobody knows everything. I don't know everything. Preston from Big Games doesn't know everything. And Hazem doesn't know everything either. So if you're watching this, understand that it is okay to look things up as you script. And not just okay, but it's a good thing. When you look at the Roblox documentation, when you use AI as a resource, when you even ask a friend or someone in Smarty Devs, join our Discord below by the way, how to script something, you aren't less of a scripter. You're becoming a better scripter because you are learning. Use your resources all you can and don't rely on things too much. The difference between a noob scripter who doesn't know what he's doing and a pro scripter is not that the noob uses resources, but the pro scripter doesn't. No, it's that the pro scripter also goes the extra mile to understand the resources and understand how the code works at a deeper level. Many developers, they make the mistake of watching these videos on how to make a tycoon, and then they just copy the code and don't think about how it works and don't try to figure out how everything works together in the script. It's not surprising that these developers don't learn anything. That's the real mistake. So use your resources, but the key is to make sure that you understand the code as well. And if you do that, you'll always be on the right track. Now, the next point I'm about to tell you is very related. It's to use AI as a tool, not a replacement. Leverage AI to improve your scripting, but don't rely on it. Use it to suggest improvements, debug and optimize and also learn new things about scripting. But remember, AI is not your replacement, it's your assistant. You are the one creating, not the AI. It's okay to use AI. It's a great resource. Whether you use ChatGPT 
or the Roblox AI that they have on the Create page, it's good to use your resources, including AI, but not to rely on it too much. Remember how I just told you the key is to use your resources, but also make sure that you understand how the code works as well. When you use AI, it's the same thing. Ask it questions, but also make sure that you look at what the AI is doing. You could even ask it why it's making its certain decisions. Why did you use this code? Oh, why did you use this instead of this? Why'd you use a function here instead of just writing the code without a function? These are the questions that will help you to improve as a scripter rather than using AI as a crutch. Now tip five, if you're watching this far, I'll bet you are very serious about taking your skills to the next level on Roblox. And if that's you and you want to learn even more about scripting and do it with more efficiency, join my course, Scripting Secrets. You'll get access to lessons that will help you to speed up your scripting process so much faster. And don't just take my word for it. We have tons of testimonials saying it was the fastest path they could find to learn scripting to a great level and way, way more. So if you wanna learn scripting even faster, join Scripting Secrets now. And I'll be honest, I can't guarantee you anything. It's you who has to put in the work to become a great scripter. My course is a resource, just like the video you're watching right now. If you want to reach your goals in scripting and development, you have to take action on the advice that I'm sharing with you. So just start, and I can't wait to see how far you go in Roblox scripting and what you create. Watch the video on screen now to learn even more about how to become a high-level Roblox developer.